coming week. Autumn gales spreading in, particularly during Wednesday and Thursday, and we're going to see a fair bit of rain for much of the time as well. Staying fine for you in Bournemouth, though, and I think much of the south coast continuing to hang on to a bit of sunshine yet, but there's every chance of one or two showers coming along during the afternoon, around a 40% chance, in fact, and a freshening southwesterly wind as well. But it's certainly going to be a wet night on the prom in Bournemouth, a large area of heavy rain beginning to push in from the southwest, affecting most parts of England and Wales for a time overnight before edging up into southern Scotland and Northern Ireland. Here's the weather system responsible, pushing in out of the Atlantic. Another system, though, waiting out in the wings, and this one's going to get really wound up as it comes in through Monday and Tuesday, initially spreading in another band of uh, pretty heavy rain during the course of the day on Tuesday, but also bringing some fairly strong winds. The winds initially from the southwest, the strongest winds at least, so keeping it relatively mild. But then as we go through Wednesday, gales spreading to many areas as that low runs across. And then as the winds come in from the north or northwest, it's going to turn quite a bit cooler, at least for a while, so feeling rather more like autumn, I think, during Thursday and Friday. For this afternoon, though, still plenty of autumn showers around. Not so much across Northern Ireland and Scotland. Here, a fair amount of dry and bright weather. Some of the heavier showers, though, again, across England and Wales, tending to work their way a little bit further eastwards through the afternoon. That more persistent rain just beginning to show in the southwest. Temperatures about the same as we've seen over the last couple of days, generally in the mid to high teens. But then that rain, as we've seen, working its way northwards through the course of the night, heavy and persistent for a time. Could be an inch of rain or so in some areas before the end of the night. But to the north, across Scotland, fairly clear for much of the night. Temperatures here down to about 5 or 6 degrees. That rain then working its way up across uh, Scotland during the course of tomorrow. Fairly slow moving, but still quite heavy. Lots of hefty showers packing in further to the south. And again, some of those turning out to be uh, thundery with some fairly strong winds to go with it. Tuesday then, that next band of rain beginning to push in from the south as that weather system approaches. Gale force winds in the southwest, heavy rain. Also, many northern parts of Scotland probably staying dry until quite late in the day. But it's through Wednesday and Thursday that the winds really start to pick up as that low deepens further, begins to move across out into the North Sea, pulling in a fair number of showers as well, and also those cooler winds from the north or northwest. So showers almost everywhere, gales almost everywhere during Wednesday, starting to uh, feel cooler. Thursday, the showers tending to push out across to more uh, eastern areas, becoming brighter further west, but more rain coming in across the northwest during Friday. That's the weather for the week ahead. Back to John in Bournemouth.